welcome back to the channel guys so i know there are times where you may want to access the information of the device you are running your app on maybe the number of rams the computer name the type but the only thing available on the main floater is to know if it is android ios or windows but the good news is in this tutorial i'll be telling you teaching you how you can do this with the use of this device in full package now with this package you can it will tell you all the information about the device that you need so first thing add it to your prospect the yaml file import it then you can create your function your main function and then a stateful widget so yeah we will have device info plugin equals to device info plugin okay and then because it needs to wait for some time to get the information so it will be an asynchronous function we'll create an asynchronous function here so and i'm running this i'm running a windows build so say windows info sync and then windows device info equals to await device info plugin dot windows info now i'm able to do this because i know i'm running on a windows device but as you all know flutter is for cross platform so you can't really tell whether you're running on it you can't really tell whether your app will be running on windows or mac or ios or android so the best thing we can do is to just create a function a future any device info and then we say if platform dot is android and for this we need to import the dat io because dat io then android device info android device info equals to await device info does android info yeah else if platform dot is iOS await I mean iOS device info equals to await device info dot iOS info yeah and then I'll just create one more else if platform dot is windows then windows device info equals to await device info dot windows all right and we are through it our function now so we have all this how can we show the info in our app well i'll create a string here a string device a string of info and i'll say it is empty now if it gets our info and she sets this info equals to 
Android device info dot let's say the device name you can see we have many things here the product the model manufacturer i'll be using let's say brand and we have an error here okay then if it is ios to set this info equals to ios device info dot model and if it's for windows then it should set it info equals to windows device info dot computer link okay and we have this we are almost through with our work so inside our text we just call just use the info okay and if i should run this now all right so yeah if i should run this now it seems we are having an error but and i think for the windows we can remove this non aware portion and let's run this Okay, it's still not showing yet. Yeah, I think we need an init function. And yeah, we'll initialize it. Any device info. Okay, and let's run this now. Yeah, and we can see this is the name for my laptop but there are one well, if you don't want to show only the name you want to show all the information this package can offer can show then you can have a map a map of show all info And yeah, we just set state of show all info equals to Android device info dot map. Just simple as this. Show all info equals to iOS device info dot map. And for this to show all info equals to windows device info dot map okay and we want to show this in our text to just uh, show all info show all info dot string and if I run this you can see computer name the number of cores and the system memory in megabytes this is all the information it can offer if it's for android for ios it should be more than this actually so this is where i'll be stopping today guys if you enjoyed this lesson kindly subscribe to the channel also like and share this video and i'll see you in the next out in the next lesson